Hey guys, Scope Side CX, welcome back to Super Mario Galaxy 2 Green Star Guide. So today we are getting our start on World 4. We're making some pretty good progress in here, so we're going to be starting off with, um, is there a Starbird Crystal around in this world? No, I thought there was. Okay, well, whatever. We are going to be starting off in Supermassive Galaxy. This one has a couple of tricky stars, but they're not really all that bad. It's just the fact of getting to them. This first one requires a couple of good jumps. Was well, like a triple jump right off the coin. You can hear one of them, you can like barely see one of them over there. But yeah, Green Star 1 is like literally right here in the beginning. It's like over there. So it just takes a just takes some clever jumps. I mean you can see it right there. No, I did not want Luigi, gosh darn it. I'm not going to race myself. Oh, dang it. Almost had it. You have to jump off of the coin at, like, the right time. Oh, okay, that was awesome. Yeah, you have to, like, triple jump, do the triple jump at, like, literally the last part of the coin, where it's, like, it looks like you wouldn't be able to get there, but you can. It's just barely there. The second one's a little bit tricky, so just be prepared for that. There's 175, one star, but <laughs> that was great. But I think for today I'm going to go into uh, three different star galaxies with the three stars. That's a good idea. Maybe I, that's what I should probably do from now on. Cover all the galaxies with the green stars with the three of them in one episode. Then take care of the next one with the uh, six stars. That's pretty good. So in two uploads I get 30 star, no 15. Because I get 9 and 6, yeah, that works. And, well, except for the World S stars. That one's going to be entirely another story. I would like to finish this Let's Play up, but by the time I get my 360 towards, like, the end of the year, I would like to finish it up by the end of the year so that I can move on to something new for 2011. I mean, I, as much as I love Galaxy 2, I think it's about time I move on to something else. And yeah, I still have Emerald to finish up, so I may put even more time into that, and that was, I just barely made this jump. But, um, I would like to do something on the 360 as, uh, my newest Let's Play. I might be blind. Well, it's probably going to be blind anyway. Oh, wow, that was... Oh, wait, no, I actually need to go down to this one. There we go. But yeah, it's most likely, most likely going to be a blind Let's Play, but I... Again, I've watched a Let's Play of this game before. I'm not going to spoil what it is. But, yeah, yeah. It, it, it'll come when it does. If it's like early January or something, then that's not that bad either. But yeah, as long as I get this one done, I'm not looking for... I'm, I'm looking forward to the end of this Let's Play, but at the same time, I'm not just because the last level is insanely difficult. It's got an easy mission and a hard mission. Yeah, and it's ba it's the same thing. I don't want to spoil it, but it's a really tough galaxy. All right, so yeah, I'm surprised I got that second one with as much luck as I did. That was that was pretty lucky. All these are actually not that far from each other, really. Giant Luma, you don't need it. That sucks. Alright. You know, kill a giant Goomba for old time's sake. Oh, only got some of those starters. Let's grab some of these ones too. Ah, that didn't work so well. Yeah, it seems like it's been a problem for me in this Let's Play. Like, um, bumping into walls when I spin, and it kind of like throws me off. Let's just stay right here for a moment. Long jump. Another one up. I do not need it, but it is there. Alright, come on. Yeah, there we go. I do want to get this, though, one last time. We. 
All right, so and then we just warp down to this or drop down to the launch star. Jeez. There we go. Yeah, that can be a little bit tricky with Mario with the timing, but Luigi's triple jump can easily reach that. No sweat. All right, so what is our next one? Oh, Flipsville. This should be fun. I recently saw Nintendo Capri Sun do this galaxy. It was... It looked like he had a bit of trouble with it. Wait, I think this galaxy has... Hold on, I want to check real quick. Are all galaxies like this? It's got four with three. Oh, I guess it was like that. Okay. That's kind of cool. Alright, we are going into Flipsville Galaxy. Some of these are not bad, but one is insane. It's really difficult. I can't believe how... Yeah, Green Star 3, that's the hardest one. In this entire galaxy. But, you know, stuff happens. Yeah, you can barely see the shine right there. You can hear it here, too. You can actually kind of pass this one up really easily. Yeah, if you don't see it somewhere. Or hear it. Okay, seriously, that was like total crap. Oh, I can't make it up there like that, dang it. Alright, let's hear. Oh, I'm not gonna make it. Oh, boy, that was close. Oh, yeah, I've actually. I actually just learned about this area. With all these coins and stuff, that's actually pretty cool. I, I never knew about this. I just found that out by watching the Nintendo Capri Sun Let's Play of this game. It's cool to watch other people's Let's Plays of games that you're doing because it can... One, it's a good guide for you, and two, it can help you find the ones... You, it can help you see, like, stuff that you never saw before. And you die. Alright, there's that. Now you do not spin here. Alright, and it's just right there. It's not bad, it just takes a little bit to get to because you gotta go through all the panel flipping and all that stuff. But other than that, it's not bad. Now the next one is kind of similar to the shortcut where I showed that I showed you like if you got the backflip and wall jump right you could get up on top of the little like house like buildings this one is very similar to that but it is still a green star nonetheless and I had to pick it up like that third one oh I can I want to get that third one done as soon as possible I really do because that third one is not easy it is not not by a long shot well the, the concept is very simple just getting the positioning is not easy. Yeah, I wish I could kind of skip past this, but I can't since it's technically a new star. But whatever. Alright. Oh wow, that was fail. Fail with a capital PH. I want to get... Wow, two times in a row. What the heck? That's ridiculous. Alright, I think I'm I think I'm not gonna cheat my way through this. And just go for it the old school way. I want to kill you! Yes! Alright. Oh, dang it. Didn't get him. I really wanted to that time, too. Ah, dang it. Ow. Hey, you, buddy. Get off the thing. Thank you. Oh, wait. I actually want your coin. Right, the next one, yeah, you can already see it's like right there. You will most likely have to get to it from the other side. But. It's not a big hassle at all. Oh, dang it. Well, that was quite the... Screw up. Ah, I wanted your coins. Oh, wait. I have this. Hey, do, do you guys still make star bits? 
That'd be awesome if you did, but you do not. I'm thinking of the other part. Alright, so from here you can backflip spin, wall jump spin, and it's really close. Oh, but well, there you go. <laughs> yeah, with Luigi, the, these green stars are not bad. Just because of his, his better jumping skills. But with Mario, that one could be a little bit problematic. So yeah, four green stars in ten minutes. No, wait, no, five. What am I saying? So the third one. Oh, the dreaded third one. The third one is not fun. It is not. And I wish I could just skip past all these cutscenes and stuff. But hey, what are you gonna do? That, that would take way too much editing for like a couple seconds from each star. It's I really don't think it's worth it then. And the last time we had to look at Flipsville Galaxy, thank goodness. And could you imagine if they like extended the game even more by making something like red stars or blue stars or something like that? They'd be like, no. Yeah, it's like it's like no Nintendo, I'm sorry, I'm not hundred percenting this game. Well, I really think that Nintendo had a pretty good campaign, I guess you could call it. Or a pretty good tactic for making people watch 100% the game. Like, the World S, it's very tempting because you want to know what the worlds are. Oh, I just barely made that. That was so cool. But yeah, it's really good. Ah, run away! But it's a really good idea on their part entirely. On putting in World S and then making the Green Star Challenge. It was all very well done in this game. Yeah, if I w noting on how good this game is, I can't wait to see how wait to see how good Skyward Sword is gonna be. Oh boy, that was close. And this part. Oh, this part. How I have loathed this part for a long time. Okay, seriously. Can I freaking jump on this guy's head? Thank you. Shortcut for old time's sake. Oh, I just barely made that. There we go. Oh, dang it. Alright, that was close. And the best part is, I have to wait no longer for this. Ha 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 ha. And more coins. Wait a minute. Oh, here you can do something really cool. Yeah. I saw- I spent speed on that, like, awesome. Now this one is just ridiculous. It's up there. And you actually have to, like, fall down from here to get it. No, let go. No, let go, Luigi. Oh, wow, first try. I did not think I would make that. Well, I kind of did because I watched Nintendo Capri Sun do this exact same green star, and it's just like, you go on to that part where it's horizontal, horizontal instead of vertical, and you just drop down from the corner half, the part that makes a corner. So yeah, that that's a good way to get that one. I mean, if you don't know that, you could really be spending a lot of time on that galaxy. Um, that one you need a green, that one you need a spring to do. You know what, I'll go with, no, but I already have this one open in my window. Alright, I'll go with that one, I guess. Alright, so let's see here. Okay. Uh, oh, we get a Yoshi one, a couple, a couple of Yoshi ones, actually. Okay, so I think I would, should know where these are. Wait, how did I, oh wait, no, I remember how I died two times. Alright, I can see one right there, blatantly. But it's nice to be coming back to the Starshine Beach. It really is. And the music here is also really nice. Spin, use up oxygen, haha. I got all of them. 
Chuckster, Luigi has no beef with you, so I will leave you alone. Crab ring! Catch the crab ring! Catch it again. Okay, shoot, shoot that. Where is it? Uh, it's right up there, isn't it? No, that's why I have one up, and I'm thinking of something else. Alright, where is it? It's on top of a palm tree somewhere. Dang it. Well, this should be fun. Nope. There we go. No, dang it. I need Yoshi to get up there. Alright, is it up here? I'm not sure. Does not look like it. Man, I'm not seeing it anywhere. Oh wait, no, there it is. Oh, dang it. Oh, nope. Ah, uh, wow. I just made that like ten times harder. I'm trying to focus here. Yeah, because apparently I can't do Yoshi's side flip. There we go. Got it with Yoshi, too. That's awesome. I want to look up where the other ones are. Okay, and alright. I know where the other two are. But really, can I get them done in like eight minutes? Well, the reason I say eight minutes is because on my recorder I put the 25 minutes with a commentary track. Like, I have to have a video clip going on with something so that I can record the commentary. And that's limit, that one's limit is 25 minutes. So that explains my reasoning behind that. But it's not like I can't like I can't just like record this, take a break, record the other star, and then just come back to that eventually. But really, it's not bad. Not by a long shot. My recording method actually works really well. I mean, I am getting live commentary in versus the uh, crappy post I did. I did like an entire Let's Play post commentary, and that was okay. I mean. Sunshine wasn't that bad. Alright, just got the star bits. I mean, Sunshine itself is a good game. It's just that the way I went about doing it just wasn't all that great. Star bits that I do not need, and where's Yoshi at? There he is. I knew I was missing something. Oh, you know what that reminds me of? I, I think I know how to do the dive here now. I don't know if I can get it done right or not. I'll just delete you and you. Alright, I want to try and get this right. Let's get there. Nope, crap. Did not get that right. Dang it, I didn't get that right either. Crap. I gotta go find Yoshi. Well, I don't know how you do the dive. It's kind it's weird. I know you can there with like a certain button combination, but I don't know what it is. All right, so for this one, you're going to need the dash pepper. I'm just ignore everything else. Okay, can the camera be more agreeable, please? More importantly, where's the dash pepper at? There it is. Because yeah, it's right there, and you kind of have to line yourself up just right for this. Crap. Can I get out of the water with Yoshi? Oh wait, I can. Awesome, I just might be able to get this star. Oh man, I was a little bit off. 
All right, let's try this again. Yes! Infinite Flutter Jump for the win! Yes! Yeah, Infinite Flutter Jump is also something very helpful to master when you're doing the Green Star Challenge. Like, in the normal story, it's just like, oh, you're just showing off. But here it can actually be a really good alternative. Alright, now I know where the, I know how to get this next one really easily. It's just a factor of, can I get it done in like the next five minutes? Which I, I think I would be able to, it's not a bad start at all. But yeah, um, I'm surprised that someone found the footage for that uh, Trans-Siberian Orchestra thing that I posted a link of on the YouTube bulletin. I still want to use the actual music in one of the videos just for the sheer fact that it sounds better when I use it in a video versus a recording yeah. oh, I got really laggy for a couple seconds alright now it's like everything's okay whoa easy to Luigi okay now this now this mission I believe uh, yeah Yoshi's not here it's just another Chuckster, I have no beef with you. My voice kind of cracked there. Let's just give it a second. Alright, there we go. Now what we need to do is find a Cloud Flower, wherever that is. Oh, wait, no, I know what I have to do for the Cloud Flower now. Crap. This might not be fun. Hold on. I know where it is. Oh my gosh. I think I may actually need to do this. Oh boy, I don't know if I can make it is the question. Cause you need to go all the way down and grab the cloud get the cloud flower again. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be a close one. Yeah, I always thought that the way you got coins was from the the air from coins was the air bubbles that they were in, but actually no. Coins themselves give you... Coins themselves give you air. I really don't think they need to launch you all that high, actually. Wait a minute. Where is it? Where is it from here? Wait, it's... Where is it? Oh, wow, I'm not... Yeah, I'm not gonna make that with... Just the cloud... Just with just a long jump. I thought I could... Ah, oh, dang it. Come on, Flood. Betray me. Come on, Flood. Betray me. Yes, thank you. Or no, you really are betraying Luigi because Luigi wasn't in Super Mario Sunshine. Holy crap. I almost lost the um, or the cloud flower there in the water. <laughs> but what are you going to do? Oh, the camera's like so fidgety at this part. Okay, now all we need to do is... No! Oh my gosh, I almost lost it. Alright, come on, no! No! Go this way! This way! No! Go! Go! Don't go that way! I wonder if I could just get it with a triple backflip. Oh, I just barely got that. How awesome was that? Yeah, you're, what you're supposed to do is grab, make the, pull the trampoline up so that it's facing towards the star, and then just go from there with it. But again, Luigi just breaks the star challenge, I can say that much. So there is green star number three pointing us at 183 stars. Nine stars a video, that's pretty good in my opinion. Okay, so that is going to be it for this episode of the Green Star Guide. I will see you guys next time.